And now she's going to give you the Jolly Green Giant's uh, very, very sad white, white, white cousin. This is Chloe Knox. Nice to both of you in my set. I regret everything. Christ, being this height. Oh yeah, it's wonderful. I love running into my own doorways. Um, hi, Michaels. Hello. Hi. Gosh, I wasn't sure where I was in the set. I was hoping I'd have room for another drink, but um. Oh Christ! After those last two sets, um, I decided to wear all black, you might have noticed, for, um, because even though this is not technically Lana's funeral, um, I thought, you know, TikTok, and um, whenever not her the funeral app. actually does come not about, I'm doubting app. that I will be paid to be there, so the likelihood of me actually showing up is, you know, we'll see what my schedule looks like. Um, you know what will probably happen is I'll probably fall asleep on the couch with Nikki on my chest. Um, which, yes, I do plan on my cat outliving you, Lana. But if if I have anything to say about it, he'll outlive all of us. Yes, icon of our time. Um, speaking speaking of people with cats, um, let's get right to it. Violet Star Blue is here. Yes, or is she? That alarm could go off any second now. <laughs> Violet Star Narcoleptic. Yes. Yes. Um, for those who don't know, Violet goes by the moniker The Thinking Man's Drag Queen. Yes. Um, uh, Violet, your temperament is egregious and wholly leaves much to be desired. Or translated from Violet for everybody else, you're a cunt. <laughs> Violet is perpetually single, and it's impossible to understand why. Who wouldn't want to get dom topped by Anthony Kiedis with the voice of Christian Chenoweth on Helium? <laughs> here. Um, Dynasty Banks is here. Hi. Hello. Dynasty. So named because um, uh, her performances make you want to die and she looks nasty. Um, it was really hard writing jokes for you because I, I don't know Dynasty super well and you know uh, I don't have any beef with you Dynasty. I do have beef with whoever told you leotards with matching chaps is a good fashion choice. Um, <laughs> Let's take retiring that as a standing recommendation for all of Houston Drag, frankly. Um, uh, oh, and now, now to the femme feta of Houston herself. Oh my God. No, don't give her that. Don't give her that. Femme feta. I wrote that on paper. I deserve jail time for that. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 Uh, everybody enjoy uh, Carmina fake laughing through the whole show because she's already read all of our jokes. It's still fun. Um, <laughs> no, but um, it was really hard writing jokes for Carmina for tonight because there's nothing funny about her. I mean, there is nothing funny about her. You've seen this show. There is nothing funny about her at all. But, uh, but no, Carmine and I have collaborated on a lot of numbers, so I wanted to keep the jokes light. And then I heard your set for me, fucking fuck you, my god. I should have gone in way harder, but I want to keep the mixes coming, so I kept it very light for her. You're welcome, thank you Thank you for having me. Um, I, for the longest time, I, like everybody else, just tried to write Greek jokes, and for the longest time, all I had written for her was um, Lazy Kazan. <laughs> Which I thought was very funny. Um, and now, for the guest of honor herself, Lana Blake. Yes, yes, Lana Blake, the busty beauty of Houston. Um, oh, sorry, crusty beauty of I misread that. Crusty beauty of Houston. Uh, yes, Lana is, is a legend in the Houston community. Uh, she's won so many titles. She's won Miss Gay US of A Geriatric, um, All Confederate Goddess. <laughs>
one that Luana has a, a storied sexual history in the community. In fact, she has uh, an expression that has been named after her by uh, the free clinic here in Houston, better off dead than bred by red. <laughs> Lana is such a dumb slut that she went to ITT yeah. Tech and all she yeah. left with was a UTI. <laughs> you know, uh, one of my first performances that I was starting in drag when I was just a teenage ingenue and Lana was a beautiful, stately 48-year-old was uh, a benefit show for her hernia surgery. Her hernia surgery. The next week she showed up with a new coach bag. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> It was Louis Vuitton. It was Louis Vuitton. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Yes. But, um, gosh, that's all I wrote for tonight. <laughs> thank you for having me. Yes, thank you very much. I love you, Lana. I love you. Keep doing what you're doing. And uh, let's get lunch tomorrow, and you can tell me how tonight went, uh, because uh, I'm blacked out currently. So, um, <laughs> let me know how it went. You know what? Happy Bot Mitzvah. I love you very much. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you